Hi everyone, Splinter24 here. Um, I'm just coming on to pretty much share something I picked up um, all over the weekend. Um, the Labor Day weekend. I went to the X. I mean, <laughs> even coming on here making a video, I just feel kind of, you know, I'm still saddened by Blondell's passing and you know, even making a video like this, I know she would be on here and she'd be wanting, having some encouraging words or just chiming in and, you know, I am truly going to miss her for that. Um, I'm still going through it and this weekend I had to really drag myself out of the house on Monday and I had said I'd go to the X on Saturday, but, you know, I just... It, you know, with all of that, I just wanted to kind of reflect on her and so on. So anyway, I eventually went on Monday, which was the last day. Um, the X is the Canadian National Exhibition. It has something for everyone. Rides, games, um, pavilions where you can get handcraft goods, arts and craft, animals for the kids to look at. Um, People do a lot of back-to-school shopping there. There are all sorts of vendors from different ethnic backgrounds. I got some earrings, actually, which I forgot. Um, this was before Blondell's passing when I went to one of those concerts during the week after work. Anyway, I discovered uh, um, in the Arts and Craft building a soap um, maker. She made handmade soaps from Toronto in an area called Burlington and I was so happy I didn't really buy a lot of things but this is one thing that I'm so happy that I got um, and I wanted to really share with you the best thing about it is that she her company is Canadian and um, that I'm thankful for because that makes it very accessible. Um, Burlington is a ways off for me, but um, I think she was saying that her shipping is quite reasonable. So I'm going to place more orders because I'm not a person who orders handmade soaps, but seeing them and being able to smell them, I fell in love. Um, I started using one. This is not a review. I'm just showing you and introducing um, the product you guys so if you guys are interested you can actually make purchases she doesn't know I do a YouTube channel everything I bought with my own money they were having a great sale four soaps for $20 they're typically six dollars each and uh, since I went on the last year I asked her to hustle up a deal for me so she gave me an extra one free okay I started using one I and I'm so in love with it um, first of all it smells all of them smell so good. She has shampoos and conditioners, but you guys know I have a lot of that stuff, so I didn't buy any. But you can go online and check. All of her products are definitely handmade and natural. Hold on, her guys. Her products um, are ethically sourced, so we are not getting things that, you know, from places that people are taken advantage of. Everything she has black soap in the purest form. Um, she has uh, her think her products are paraben free, SLS um, free, um, or she paraben free. So really you're getting good value for your money and the size of the soaps are great. So um, the first one I got, I'm not sure which one this is because y'all I was just smelling stuff and buying but I got this one which is the shea butter soap and they're good size um, this is the shea butter soap and this is recommended it's a hundred percent shea butter and this is recommended for people with a dry skin so I can't wait to um, to use this because I do have dry skin um, to probably wash my face or whatever. 100% shea butter um, is used in this. Um, it, this one doesn't really have a smell for, per se. It's just fresh. Okay, the one that I'm using now, I cut in half. And I think this must be the mango papaya. It smells amazing. When I shower with this soap, and I can imagine with it, because I... 
was getting soaked for dry skin pretty much and then afterwards when I smelled the stuff I was like I'm gonna just go by smell so I got the shea butter for dry skin but this is so moisturizing she uses oils and so on in it and I cut this one in half Hubster ain't touching none of my soaps okay because he couldn't care less so this is in my little soap dish on the side I take it out of the shower put it away because he'll use it because this is amazing this is amazing okay this I think is a mango papaya y'all I wish you guys had smell a vision so you could smell this this one it comes wrapped in um, these this paper with the um, name of the company Skinalicious Skinlicious Soaps and um, this one was the second one I got I think that I chose which was the oatmeal and honey and this is extremely moisturizing she says this one smells kind of has a like a vanilla -ish smell to it and it smells it smells natural it doesn't smell like manufactured um, you know just a manufactured smell no it's just completely legit okay this one I don't remember which one this is but this is the lily of the valley I think and it has some little shavings here um, I forgot to get the coconut made with coconut milk with coconut shavings on it this is amazing too I love this one it smells good I can't wait to use them then I said I'm not really into buying soaps um, like this but I was just drawn to this thing and I, I couldn't wait and I was so excited because all of the vendors there are pretty much from Canada this one I don't remember the name of it I'm sorry guys if I do I'll put it up here somewhere but it's beautiful it's like a pink with um, with green with like a dark bluish green here so um yeah I just wanted to come on and show you what I got I encourage you to go on her website I'll put the link down below check it out as I said I'm not she doesn't even know I do a YouTube channel she I'm just seeing it because I like the product and so far this little piece that I'm using I'm absolutely loving it like when I get out of the shower I feel as if you know the soap you know when soaps have this drying effect and you just feel like you have to put on lotion immediately with that you feel so moisturized like I soap up and it lathers so well lathers so well yet because of the smell I lather up wash off lather up wash off again because it smells so good when I go when I come out of the bathroom it's as if I've had a bubble bath because the it the room just permeates with this beautiful scent it's not perfumey it's just mild and and nice um yeah so I'm gonna show you the earrings that I got yeah also. I got these kind of an animal print earring from a booth um, the ladies in there are from Kenya and I think this is made of bone but I really love it on um, yeah I've got some other things but I mean I'm just highlighting the stuff that will interest you but I really got some great deals these were like three dollars guys and they're like about four inches long so love these um, so again I'm encouraging you go and um, go through this website I can guarantee you're gonna love the variety they seem to have a lot of variety um, for hair stuff also she has shampoo bars um, I don't didn't see any liquid shampoos in stock but she does have them listed there uh, what else um, stuff for your face she but um, black soap as I said was on there I didn't buy because I have some that uh, Lula Matu had sent for me some time ago that I haven't used so yeah um, take care y'all I will see you guys sometime soon um, yeah and I just want to thank everybody for all the prayers that you sent out to the family of Blondell. I I can't speak of her enough, um, but as as requested, you know, I just know that they're going through a hard time right now. Those girls, I can't stop thinking about those children. Um, 
check out Tasty Red Bones video a tribute to her and if you would like to make some contributions there are some details that uh, Tasty Red Bone Janae uh, posted on her video in a video in the form of a video and I'll put that link below too okay um, yeah so this you know it threw me for a loop I, I don't think I was eloquent enough the last time when I spoke about her um, and I, I I just don't have the words guys um, it's just a great sense of loss you know her presence I already miss on here and I truly truly um, I don't have any words I don't have any words 